Hi, Michael Hurwitz here for CreativeCow.net. In this tutorial, we're going to be looking at image stabilization in Vegas Pro 10. And this is a new feature in Vegas Pro 10. One thing I found out about using image stabilization is that I can crash Vegas reliably by trying to stabilize an MXF file. This is an MXF file from a Panasonic HVX200. And the workaround I found for this is to render it to a new track as a QuickTime. So that's how I'm going to start out. Just go to Tools, Render to New Track, and Save. So here's my new track. I'm just going to left click on this audio track, then right click and delete the track. I'm not interested in the audio. So this QuickTime file is what I'm going to stabilize. So you can see as I play this that there's a certain amount of jiggle in this track. That's what we're going to be trying to minimize through stabilization. The first step is just to click on the clip to select it. Then go to Tools, Video, Stabilize Media. We have a number of profiles here for various types of footage and for various levels of intensity as far as how much analysis you want to do. I'm going to just stick with general footage, medium analysis. You can detect fast camera motion. We don't have that here. You can select pan, tilt, and roll, or just pan and tilt, or pan, tilt, roll, and zoom. I'm going to stick with the default, just pan, tilt, and roll. You can also do rolling shutter correction. This is a type of distortion that you get with fast camera movements or with fast movements of objects across the scene. We don't have that here either. So I'm just going to click Apply. Now you'll notice that we have a third clip here now. This is the MXF clip. This is the clip that we're using as our original now to stabilize and this is our stabilized clip. And the clip that you stabilize and the stabilized clip are stored as takes. So if I right click here you can see we have two takes, the new track and the new track stabilized. So this makes it very easy to compare different stabilized clips and to compare them with your original. So for example, if I go here now and go to Take, and I can go back to my original track, then I can go back up here to Tools again, and up to Video, Stabilize Media, and choose a different option here, General Footage Intensive Analysis, let's say, and click Apply. And now you'll notice there's another clip here, and this is Subclip 2 Stabilized. So this was the first one we did, and this is the second one we did. So I can look at these, then I can go here, right click, go to a different take, play through that, and decide which one of them, if any, seems to have done the best job. And if I want to, I can go back to my original clip as well if I don't like any of the stabilization. So that's the basics of image stabilization in Vegas Pro 10. I hope this has been helpful and thanks for tuning in.